Hey class, let's all play a game together in VR. Let's talk about this. Hey class, welcome back. Mr. G here, your online video professor. Now, today's class is gonna be around sports and getting everybody to play all at the same time. Now, I am, again, deep diving into VR, virtual reality. This game I came across a little while ago, this is called Knock. This is a fantastic game. I absolutely love this game. Why? Because this is a game that we can all play together. There is no one left out to just not play. That's the best part. Uh, so this is a eSport kind of title that we're looking at on the Quest. Now, this game uh, does retail for, so you do have to buy this game. I think it's about 10 bucks or so. But reason why I want to put push this one out there, especially for us in the education space, is because this game allows all users to have the same playability. What does that mean? That means that no matter who you are, what skill level you are, boy, girl, anything in between, you're everybody's covered. You don't have to know anything about the person other than can they help you score the goals on your team. That's all you need to know. Uh, this is really cool because uh, I've played this with myself, other teachers, uh, friends of mine, where I will be either in my classroom and I'll have another uh, teacher in their classroom where we'll both be in the same headset game so we can play together. This allows us to uh, play anywhere that we have internet connection. So that number one is just super cool because we can have a game, have a match, and it, we don't even have to be in the same space. I'm a big proponent of global community, us all working together, us all being friends, partners together, working together, everything, just try and create that, that sense of community on a global scale. This provides that. And, and having our students see that we are all together, we're all working together, we're all can be teammates, I think is a wonderful, wonderful thing. So back to um, using this as a sports element. Now, again, I'm an art teacher. However, me and my PE health coach teacher, we are working on VR together. We're trying to do something together to help bridge, the, build the education of all of our students and give them something else to do and do it in a way that we can um, reach every student possible at every uh, ability level. And with that said, one of the things that we do have to strive and work on is social emotional building. This game is providing our students to work in a socially co co uh, collaborative and cooperative experience. We're all working together. You, you're you building those team relationships that you would on the field. Don't have to be outside worrying about heat stroke from kids. I, I, I teach down here in Atlanta and we have hot, hot summers and that is a major problem. So doing something like this where we're, we can be in the AC, air conditioning, and you can even have kids playing this in chairs if uh, mobility is a concern for some of them, that all of us can work together and then you have a, a great ex, uh, sport experience all at the same time. Now, you guys have been watching some of the gameplay. Let's talk about this gameplay. So this game, the best way to explain it is it's kind of like you mixed soccer, archery, and kickball all at the same time because it, you're, you're doing all of those different elements. Uh, you can play it with bots. You can play it with friends if everybody's got the game. Uh, it's not a hard game to learn. It's a very difficult game to master. Uh, I was showing my math, one of my math teachers is, and he totally got ja j uh, jazzed. He is a hardcore soccer fan, uh, football in his native country, and he saw this and it was just like, I want to play this right now. Uh, in addition to uh, being able to use this for, for math class, I'm always big on trying to find some sort of uh, cross-curricular activity to do with my teachers so that we can all work collaboratively because, again, like I said, if we work collaboratively, we work better together. Now, I'm a big fan, again, of doing an eSport variant instead of a traditional sports class for myself. And it's not just because, well, I, I don't sport. But uh, that does play a big role in it, and I just always am trying to come up with new, fun, and interesting things for us to do together. And I'm going to go ahead and close it out today for today's time. Don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, and share on all the various platforms. Get the message out there to as many teachers, friends, students that we possibly have. Again, I'm trying to out be out there educating the masses, trying to get the message out there about how, mu how much benefits are there in the arts and in virtual reality in the e-space. Uh, if you guys had a question, comment, or concern during today's class, don't forget to raise your hand in the comments below. Happy answers questions from my classmates as always i will see you guys next class so until then later guys